after spending nearly 20 years in prison for a crime he didn't commit. Juan Rivera shared his story of being wrongfully convicted of murder with students in the NIU College of Law. I think it's an unbelievable opportunity for my students to hear about how a trial attorney, an appellate court judge, and the ultimate defendant was found not guilty. It's quite a story for our students. The case is one of the most um, controversial, sensational cases out of Lake County, and uh, the facts of the case unfold like a John Grisham novel, and um, the injustices that we have seen along the way made it heartbreaking for all of us who, who worked on the case. And even before we had the exonerating DNA, we could look at this case and we knew we were uh, looking at someone who was innocent. Rivera said he hopes students can apply what they learn from his story as they move forward in the law profession. I think it's important to let them know how important they are, you know, to individuals such as myself, you know, that have been wrongly incarcerated to look at a bright future, you know, based upon these students. You know, they're the future and they're the ones that are working hard to help those that are in prison wrongfully convicted, you know, so I think it's important that I share with them how I feel. Uh, I had to fight for a lot, for my shoes, for my food, this sounds crazy, but for my virginity. Many people tried to rape me while I was in there because of this case. And I had to fight. I had to fight pipes, bricks, anything to defend myself. But I never lost myself, even though I, I conformed myself to be a monster in a place that literally is hell. I still came out not being bitter. In order to be bitter, that means I would have to live life angry. And I don't have time to be angry. You know, I just need to move forward with my life, you know, get my education get a job, which, by the way, I'm working at Northwestern in the Medical Science Research Lab, and I will be going to college at the same time at Northwestern, you know, so I'm looking forward to a brighter future. I'm not thinking about the past. That's in the past.